Do we know anything about Dylan? Is he going to be here? He's not. Okay. I'd like to call this uh, meeting of the Education Committee order 6.45 p.m. Uh, yes, sir. Father, we thank you for uh, the opportunity to be here tonight. We pray that you would continue to be with our county, be with our leaders, be with our EMS, be with our school students, and all of our employees, Lord. We just ask that you continue to bless our our county. We uh, we just lift up those that need special touch from you, Lord. And as always, we ask that you just forgive us for we fail and fall short. Uh, just be with us tonight during this meeting and deliberation. In Jesus' name, amen. Yeah, look for a motion to approve the agenda. So moved. Second. All those in favor? Aye. Uh, Approval of the minutes for January 2nd? So moved. Second. Pilot Payne, I was not here. All those in favor? Aye. All those opposed? We have no one signed up to speak. Uh, could, I, could I get on that? I was in the middle sure. of uh, redressing my, my commissioner, and I apologize, sir, if I work with your partner. Uh, I'll just try to represent the people. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, Kevin Baker, 1448 Road. Um, I just wanted to talk about what I perceive or that I've been told about a traffic issue up at the Liberty Creek. Um, now, I've heard from another one. Mr. Chairman, this morning. Point of order, it's not only Jenny and I. We were already 45 minutes late. Oh, okay. I've got a lot of safety issues. I'm okay with that. Thank you. I'm, I'm okay. Forget it. I have no report. Mr. Mayor, you have one? No report, Mr. Chairman. Director Scooby, you're not here. Okay. No old business. Uh, first set of amendments are all uh, for information only. Motion. Okay. Uh, 10B. Number one, I have two questions, but we do not have any representatives from the school board uh, on budget number five. Uh, I have a motion for discussion later. I'll move in agreement for B one two. Second. I would like to talk about budget number five. Yes, I have a motion. Second. Uh, when I looked at it. First of all, it says appropriation of new revenue. And that's one, one flag that went up right there. And then, whenever I read the explanation in our office memorandum, it said attached is a minimum request to allocate uh, revenue funds for the seven medi account, which is a medical account, paying for uh, Medicare, and then they're using it for services. I just wondered where, you know, how that was being done when you're taking one thing from one account that's supposed to be for Medicare and services. So, I just don't have anybody here to answer that question. Mr. Chair, if I may, I believe Director Lankford or Dr. Lankford or whichever title he wants to use uh, was, had replied to that and that's using uh, for students with the IEPs in the county. Well, I know that's what they're using for. Okay. It, services. And those are federal funds. Yeah, which can, which have to be used that way, and, and then they can be adjusted from line item to line item. But, but he's not here, so I, I can't yeah. say. Yeah, that's all. I, all I was asking for was an explanation. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah.
officially medical funds for employees or for Now, I understand, Mr. Chair, these are these are just for IEP students with IEP. Yeah, yeah, I understand that. So, my husband was a physical therapist, and they just do contract therapy in the school, so oh, yeah, it would make sense that you would have some students that would receive speech therapy, occupational therapy, so that some of those students would be covered through medicare through Medicare. Right. That's not Medicaid. It's Medicare. Medicare, right? Medicare. Because of their diagnosis. Right, services have, provided yeah, through their yeah. IEP, whether it's yeah. through the nurse in the school or yeah, yeah. yeah. And then let's say the other part of there where it says appropriation of new revenue. Mm. That's another question. Mm. I'm not sure what John wanted to share with them. Are they asking for new money? Of the subject. So, yes, sir. Did uh, did the one of the new systems say that you would not be able to get that number and say? Yes. I got an email that. Oh, that is. Yeah, that William Lampkin. Yeah, he was, uh, Dr. Langford responded and said that he was invited by Representative Lambert to go down to the uh, State of the State address tonight and plans for that in his email, but I don't know, I, I can't speak to what well, well, he didn't he didn't address it, anybody else would be here in the email, so I don't know. I'll have to say this, and this is not a slap at Dr. Langford or anyone, but I never remember the time that I was So 
somebody from the Department of Education. Those two questions. At least, at least the, the appropriation of the way to be one in another. Be one roster. You want to change some that's, that's sure. That's my proposal. So the mayor of the second agreed to that, add that to the one goes through. Uh, uh, budget amendment number five will not be on the consent agenda. It will be there, and we will ask a representative of the school for uh, to answer those questions. Must be the vote on it. I'm just restating, okay. restating the motion. So we're going to close the motion and second.